Evacuation orders have been given to more homeowners living in what's being called a dangerous neighborhood. Yeah, four years ago, a sinkhole appeared in a Black Hawk neighborhood, and that led to the discovery of an old mine underneath the home. Kelloland's Tyler Lauder revisits the community as new information comes to the surface. Engineers studying the area say the remaining homeowners should leave because soils under and around their homes contain gypsum and present a very serious threat to their lives and property. Over the past four years, many residents from the fence behind me have been wondering what's going to happen to their homes and the property that they own. And now several others here out in Hideaway Hills close to around 150 different homes are being told that they're going to also have to evacuate a place that they've called home for a long time. The mine is filling up with water and causing issues with the utilities in the area. So the utilities are collapsing and devolving and deforming and and it's now at the point where it is absolutely hazardous for people to be living in the neighborhood. Stuart and Tanya Junker were the first to move their home into what is now Hideaway Hills and have put their heart and soul into this house. Well, no one's happy about it. I mean, we got our house now and we have to find a new place to live and start making payments again. Interest has doubled since we bought our house. Some, a lot of us are retired, our house is paid for, now we got to start paying a new house off. None of us signed up for this. Um, no one would have moved out here in this beautiful neighborhood if we had known that there was a mine underneath us. This was our retirement home. And to know that we have to start over is hard to wrap your head around. An attorney is now working to return value back to each household affected by this mess. We are hoping that each person is um, paid for the damage of the loss of their homes so that they can pay their mortgages, they can get their equity out of their homes, and they can use it to move on with their lives. That's the goal. In Blackhawk, Tyler Lauder, Killaland News. And those proceedings will begin this summer and could finish up as soon as April of next year.